Hey guys, welcome to week three, day four, the coronavirus lockdown madness. Sorry I missed yesterday, but I was feeling a little low energy. I don't know if some of you know, but I have a illness and I need to get treatment and the treatment kept getting postponed because of the whole coronavirus. You can only have so many patients in a room at a time. <coughs> so I was starting to feel low energy and just wasn't myself yesterday. So I took a little break, but I'm back because I'm super energized. I went today. It was, uh, yeah, I mean, the safety situation, you do feel better because there's lots more room in between chairs and, um, but it's still really scary because you're like, I'm in a hospital, which you should feel safe. But at the same time, you're like, how many sick people who has the coronavirus? But they were really good. There were hand sanitizers all over the place. We were giving masks and gloves and, um, it was great. It was fine. And now I feel energized and, uh, so does my boyfriend. Let's just talk about men for a second. So I just want to know if this is like an Italian man thing or man thing in general. So um, my particular man situation is he's as slow as a sloth. Okay, so one of the things is that every week we have cleaning the house uh, duty, right? So I uh, am able to do three rooms in maybe an hour really well. He can do one, and it's an all-day affair. He has to have everything laid out his way, and he has to listen to music, and then he pitter-pots, and he sits down, check his phone, then he mops like a, a tile, then sits back down because he's tired. And I've already cleaned like the entire house except for one room, and he's still on one room. All-day affair. I'm not kidding you. Second, when we go out, which is definitely not anything we're going to do anytime soon, if it's in the morning, oh my God, it's so painful. If we ever have to travel and we have a trip, I have to calculate two extra hours before being somewhere with him because you get him out of bed, again, a sloth. First of all, he needs 30 minutes in bed before getting out of the bed because he says, debe decompressare. So he has to decompress. Does anybody know what that means? So he spends 30 minutes just having downtime in the bed. Then he gets up and he checks his phone, calls his mom, turns on some music that he picks out. He gets up, slowly walks to the kitchen, has like a biscuit. Then comes back because he doesn't feel like he wants to listen to this song. Then he goes in the bathroom and he just, you know, brushes one tooth at a time. Then he comes back and he starts to get ready. And he's like, oh, I don't know what to wear. And he wears the same thing, a black t-shirt and jeans every time. But he's still undecided. I'm at the door with my bag, full makeup, hair done, ready to go. And he's still picking out his shoes. The funny thing is that he owns one pair of shoes. But for some reason, that puts him in a tilt. So I'm like, we need to go. And he's still like looking around the house for a sock. Oh my God. He needs three hours to get out of a door, people. Italian man or all men? One time, talking about non-multitasker, he uh, calls me. And I'm having a mammogram, but I said, let me answer this. So I'm having my boobs smashed in a machine. And he's like, oh my God, hot water's not coming out of my sink. And my roommate's going to get upset and he's going to leave. And I don't know what to do. And I was like, don't worry, I'll text you my uh, fix-it man's number. Great. Other bad boob be being smashed. He says, oh my God, he's not answering his text. What should I do? I'm like, okay, hold on. Side getting checked. He was like, um... Hey, fix it, man. My boyfriend's trying to call you. Answer the phone. Call Raph. Hey, Raph, the fix it man's going to call you. Turn to the side. Raph calls. Oh, everything's okay. He's going to come over tomorrow. Great. All right. Goodbye. Checks under. I text Raph. Oh, by the way, I just wanted to know, did you ever get a hold of Laura's sister about, you know, maybe taking classes at that music school? What? How can you ask me that in this time when I am so stressed? There's no hot water coming out of my sink. My roommate's going to leave and not pay me rent. And then how am I going to make money by the end of the month? And you're asking me if I called the school? Meanwhile, I'm having a mammogram. 
and texting him and my fix-it man, and he's upset because I asked him to do more than one task at a time, people. Italian man or all men? Leave me your comments, let me know, and stay home, stay strong, stay away from that virus. I'm Bocce till tomorrow.